All right, little practice before the 2016 season starts here in a few weeks. Been having some shoulder issues this year. I'm a, I'm a righty normally. Uh, I haven't been able to shoot my bow right-handed. I'm having issues holding it left-handed. So tried tried left-handed and had no issues. So my buddy let me as bow tech this year. I've been shooting it for a few weeks. And uh, surprisingly, don't shoot that bad. So take a few practice shots, getting things ready. Starting to get a little cooler. Season will be here before we know it. Not too shabby. All right, October 9th, second weekend of deer season here in Texas. I'm heading back to the deer lease where I hunted last weekend. I'm gonna go to a new spot. Was out there yesterday. We uh, set up a new spot in the back. Just hadn't cleared the limbs enough to hunt opening weekend and there's been some really good activity back there. So snuck in there yesterday uh, afternoon trim the shooting lines a little bit and snuck out of there so we're gonna go in there first thing this morning and see what happens Got some nice mature bucks hitting that area so wind should be perfect north there's a northeast wind one will be right in our face blow into an agricultural field behind us so I think it's gonna be a good spot nice and cool again this morning for early October 60 degrees so Movement should be good. We'll see what happens. Excited again. 2016 season. Let's kick it off nice and early like we did last year.
had a couple and he snuck in just perfect like I hoped he would. Big wide nine point so. Whew. Hopefully the work begins. I'm gonna I'm gonna give him plenty of time. Like I said, I didn't I think I hit that opposite shoulder, hopefully. Hopefully it's an easy track job. I'm out, I'm out here by myself, so we'll see what happens. End of the road outdoors, a good start for 2016. Second weekend, exactly what happened last year. All right, well, I went down and checked the arrow. Got pretty good penetration. I think we're gonna be in pretty good shape, so giving him about 30 minutes, I'm gonna start packing up my stuff slowly and and heading down, see if we can get on a trail and recover that big boy. Blood's been a little sparse, but I'm following a good trail. There he is. There he is. on the time links but he's wide and he's mature you know don't have a lot of free time but was able to come out here yesterday and get this stand set up because we've been seeing these deer um, pattern through this area of the, of the farm and uh, man just like last season quick setup and uh, quick hunt I mean it was great so He's, he's not going to break any records, but uh, he's a mature deer, and that's, that's our goal out here on this ranch is, is shooting mature deer. So I'm going to get going on getting him set up and clean him out and get him back to the house. I had a, uh, shot a big buck last year, weighed almost 200 pounds, and uh, had a bunch of deer steaks made out of them before I could eat them. Uh, we lost power and didn't realize it and freezer uh, didn't kick back on and lost all the all the meat so this will help fill the freezer for the year well here he is it's got a huge body on him this guy was not easy to drag out of the woods by myself but uh, seen him on camera a few times didn't have a great stand set, so I came in yesterday afternoon, made a quick adjustment, let it sit overnight, and then came in first thing this morning, he popped out. Had five or six little bucks there. He was definitely the old mature buck out of the group. Won't score great, but uh, you know it's all about shooting mature deer. <clears throat> it's been an interesting season for me. I hurt my shoulder a few months back and haven't been able to uh, I'm a right. I'm a righty. I haven't been able to draw my bow back, and uh, my good buddy George Zidan lent me his old Bowtech, 15-year-old Bowtech. Did the trick. Thanks, Georgie. Really appreciate it. It's all about having good friends. I don't know what I would do if I if I wasn't able to uh, use your bow. So I appreciate it. Thank you. Well, I'm gonna get him cleaned up in the ice chest. Back on home. Got a lot of season to go too. Excited about that. Early October. Wait till the rut picks up. Here we go.